Emerson Hancock. He is the uh, starting pitcher for the M's here tonight. Former first round pick out of the University of Georgia. Number six overall as a matter of fact. But this is just his sixth major league start. He made three last year. And this is number three this year. Gets jammed here. Swinging at a pitch in off the plate. Polanco ranging out towards the chalk in right field. Two pitches and quickly out number one. Swing and a miss, chase it well off the plate. And that fastball's got a little extra gear on it early on tonight from Emerson Hancock. He got him. Oh, what a smooth top of the first inning for Emerson Hancock. Had everything working, a couple of strikeouts. Imanaga has made two starts. He has been incredibly good. Six shutout innings yeah. against Colorado. And then against the Dodgers, four innings of work. But he pitched very well in that game as well. In the air, out towards left center. Bellinger is there. And Cody makes the catch. The next pitch bounced out towards second base, where Horner has it and throws him out. And that's out number two. 3 2 down. And that one in there got him. Shota Imanaga gives himself a hand. Cubs have allowed two first inning runs all year, fewest in the majors. End of one, no score. So Emerson Hancock has gotten the first four. That he has faced. Dansby Swanson stands in. Line drive, base hit into left field. A soft single by Dansby Swanson. Let's see if that begins a Cubs rally with one away and a scoreless game in the second inning. Here's Michael Bush. He's homered in back to back games. Hit a long one last night. Line drive, base hit, and that's into right field. Swanson's not stopping. Dansby. Well, hang on at third as the throw comes into second. They're at the corners. Michael Bush stays high. A great opportunity to draw first blood here. And the pitch to Horner. Nico lines one center field sinking. That's going to be caught by Rodriguez. Tagging is Dansby Swanson and scoring the game's first run. RBI for Horner. Cubs lead one to nothing. Bottom of the second one nothing Cubs. Mitch Hanniger leading off the inning. Wrapped on the ground to short. Scooped up by Swanson as he moved to his left a step or two. And the ball gets away from Bush. That's going to be an error I believe on Bush. Jorge Polanco, the batter. Hanniger at first base, a ball and two strikes. On a line into center field, it drops in front of Bellinger. Mariners have a couple of men on base right away. It's Imanaga's job to pick up his mates and get out of it. Swing and a miss. And Garver down on strikes. And there's that heater up in the zone at 94. One out, two on. Dylan Moore steps in. Moore swinging a high drive deep into the gap in left center field. Hap going back to the warning track. The wall reaches up at the top of the fence and he makes the catch. Dylan Moore almost rode it out of here. So now runners on at first and third with two outs. And here's third baseman Luis Arias. And again, the Mariners are looking for that clutch base hit. Down the left field line. It's a fair ball into the corner. Hanniger scores. Polanco rides into third. He's being held there. Luis Arias ties this game of the second inning. That's the first run yielded by Imanaga. It is unearned. Man, it's second and third, two outs. This is a big plate appearance right here for Sebi Zavala, the catcher. Swing and a miss. Imanaga gets the strike out. He goes four seamer up, and that ends the inning. But the Mariners get the equalizer. It's 1 1. 1 to 1 tie, third inning. The batter is Seiya Suzuki. Off the mark as he swings and golfs this one in the air. Left field. This ball's back on its way. Gone! Seiya Suzuki a home run. And the Cubs have taken a 2 1 lead. Suzuki doing damage in Seattle. That has a familiar ring to it. This was pretty cool yesterday. For the very first time, Seiya had the chance to meet. Ichiro really enjoyed the conversation and really enjoys playing in this ballpark because he saw it so much as a kid, guys. Cubs two, Mariners one. Here's Mitch Hanniger leading off. Menaga's first pitch swung on. Line drive past the shortstop in the left field for a base hit. Mitch Hanniger tying run aboard. Mitch Garver, the batter, hit hard through the left side for a base hit. The Mariners put two men aboard. Second time through, they're starting to get on the fastball. High fly ball, left field, hat. Settling under it, shy of the track. Ian is there, makes the catch, and the runners will stay put. Hanniger at second, Garver at first. Fly ball, center field playable. Bellinger right there, he's got it. No runs for the Mariners. They leave a pair. So one down here in the top of the fifth. Cubs with a 2 1 lead over the Mariners. Mike Talkman stands in. That one sliced down into left center, and it'll fall for a hit. Mike Talkman had knocked the other way. 
And with one out, a man aboard, and the batter will be Miguel Amaya. Crawford has to get to him quickly. Polanco at second. On to first for the double play. It's another quick inning for Emerson Hancock. The payoff. Lashed out to Julio, giving some ground. And Julio makes an awkward angle catch. Wow. Get that ball was knuckling on him. Looked like he had a pretty good beat on it and changed directions. Got a chance to go a full six innings for the first time in his career, facing a pretty dangerous bat in Christopher Morrell. He popped him up. J.P. Crawford drifting into shallow left. He's got it. And what a night for Emerson Hancock. For the first time in his young career, he goes six innings and allows just two runs to the Chicago Cubs. Bottom of the sixth inning. Shota Imanaga pitching another good ball game for the Cubs. Fastball just a little bit inside. Hanniger gets the leadoff walk. Didn't miss by much. That one inside. He's walked back to back guys. I'm going to guess they're going to stay with him one more hitter and see if he can do some good. One and two. On the ground to third. Oh, nice play. Morrell gets up and throws him out. Great play, Christopher. And a nice pick at first by Bush on the one hop throw. Imanaga leaves. Runners at second and third, one down, bottom of the sixth inning. Mark Leiter Jr. is the new pitcher. Line drive, caught out of the air, Morell at third. Excellent play. Christopher has saved multiple runs in this inning with his defense. Bottom of the sixth inning, two outs, runners at second and third. In the air, and Leiter is going to get out of it. Hap is there. Great work, Mark Leiter Jr. And now it's Michael Bush, a single and a fly out. They play him to pull on the infield. Swing and a high fly ball. Well struck right field. That ball's out of its way. And gone! Michael Bush, third straight game, and the Cubs now lead it 3-1. Hey, this is becoming a habit for this guy. Cubs have Miguel Amaya to lead off, then Ian Happ and Seiya Suzuki against both. Swing and a high fly ball. That's pretty well struck left field. That one back, and that is gone. Miguel Amaya, first homer of the year. More insurance, and the Cubs now lead it 4-1. to one. Adbert Alzali trying to nail it down for Shota Imanaga and the Chicago Cubs. On the ground, Swanson charges, scoops it up with one hand, and throws it out. Now the 0-2 fly ball very playable shallow right Horner backpedaling and calling but Suzuki says I've got it maybe not in so many words but he does make the catch and that's out number two. The one two is hit on the ground and through that left side hole and a base hit and it will get back to the top of the order now for J.P. Crawford bottom of the ninth two down the pitch. Swing and a miss, and the Cubs win the ball game. And that is the final out of the game—a strikeout—and the Cubs win by a score of four to one to even this series.